So female bears that are pregnant enter the hibernation in mid to late November, and they'll stay there till the first week of April. So that's almost five months that a bear is in a den if they're an adult female bear. During that time, they don't eat, they don't drink, they don't produce any waste, and they'll produce cubs. Cubs are born about the second week of January. Average litter size in Pennsylvania is three. Um, so this particular bear is right where she belongs. She had three cubs today. Um, they'll, like as I mentioned, they'll stay into hibernation until the early first week of April, early April. They'll come out of the den and they'll stay here local uh, for a week or two. And then they'll start to spread out a little bit more as uh, spring green up occurs. Um, these cubs are obviously in great condition. They weigh between six and seven pounds, which is a typical weight for this time of year. What we see for uh, types of dens really varies across the state. We have bears that den on top of the ground in what look like large birds nests. We have bears that den in rock cavities. Uh, and this particular bear is in a hollow log. And so this is a kind of a unique one. We don't see too many of these. Um, it's very dry, fairly warm in there. Um, but we do have bears that den right out on top of the open ground that are very successful at producing cubs. So they don't all need a den like this. We, we do see a lot of variety in den type. This year we have the, the good fortune of actually documenting a bear that is denned underneath a deck. Uh, we have a, a webcam on that, uh, that den right now that has produced a lot of interest among the public. And one of the questions we get is, is that bear in danger under that deck? Water is dripping on the bear, snow melts and things like that. And, and people have expressed a little bit of concern. And, and the reality is, is that that's a fairly sheltered den. We do have dens that are in the wide open. And so um, not every bear needs a lot of shelter uh, for a den. That particular bear is doing just fine. So we have a cub here that's almost seven pounds. Um, and it, it looks like what you'd expect a bear to look like, just small. But the reality is, is that when cubs are born, they weigh about a half a pound, about eight ounces. Um, so they're nearly hairless, their eyes are closed, their ears are tiny little buds. So they look a lot different than they do right now. But yet this cub is only about nine weeks old. And so they go from that eight ounces, a very dependent on their mother for survival, to a nearly seven pound cub in eight weeks. By November, uh, when they're ready to go into hibernation again at 11 months, they'll weigh close to 80 pounds. So cubs grow very quickly the first year of life. And when they're in the den, um, even though the female bear is not taking in any food, she is producing very rich milk. In fact, milk fat content can be up to 30% during part of uh, the early lactation. So these cubs are getting all of their nutrition from their mother, and it's very good nutrition because they grow very quickly when they're in the den.